Hello, my name is Dinis and I'm co-founder of company AirOwns. We build heavy lift drones for industrial cleaning and firefighting. When I look at these pictures, I would like to say it's wrong. It's not the right way to do the job. We will change the industry of people in ropes, services done by helicopters and cranes. For example, wind industry is losing up to 20% of their efficiency and revenue because of the ice and dirt on the blades. Erosion costs a lot of money in maintenance. Right now, cleaning, de-icing, ice phobic coating apply is difficult and not safe task for them, and it costs a lot of money. This is our drone in action. We can do the job 20 times faster, and even if we do that five times cheaper, we have 70% of profit margin. The drone is powerful. It can lift 200 kilos. Electricity and the water comes from the ground, so we can clean, de-ice, and do the job endlessly. We have started to clean our customers commercially last, uh, last month. And we can do more. This is a technology of ice phobic coating apply, which we will do next month. This month, actually. These ice phobic coatings are preventing not only from the ice building up on the leading edge of the blade during the winter season, but they are also protecting from the erosion of the blades. These coatings need to be reapplied every year. We are the right technology to do that. We can do more. We can clean buildings, oil, gas, solar, and other industries. And that's not it. We can do firefighting. Imagine that the highest ladders in the world can reach up to 70 meters. They need 20 minutes to deploy them. We can get up to 300 meters in less than one minute. Imagine the firefighters in wildfires pulling the hose up the hill to extinguish the fire. We can do that with the drone much safer and faster. Let's not risk a life. However, we are focused now on our cleaning business services, and it's multi-billion dollar business for us. By developing new sets of robotic arms in front of the drone, we can do more services for our customers. For example, we can repaint signal stripes on the wind turbine blades. We can repair small, small cracks on the blades for the wind industry. Therefore, we will have more revenue from our customers from each turbine. 10 months ago, we published a video of how we are de-icing the wind turbine. Now we have all of the world's largest wind turbine companies willing to do business with us. Thank you. Thank you very much. Um, why wouldn't someone want to try one of your drones? Why wouldn't? So why wouldn't it? So I, you have uh, you mentioned the large um, wind turbine companies, but um, in, in the whether it's firefighting or one of the other segments, why wouldn't someone want to want to use this? Four of the largest uh, firefighting truck manufacturers are now in negotiations with us uh, to build a solution together with us. Our first focus is wind turbines. Our first market where we go, where we're focused on, is wind industry. But why wouldn't someone want to use this? I mean, it seems as if this, seems, uh, this, this is something that everyone in these industries want, would want to use. What sort of uh, questions or pushback do you get when you, when you talk to potential? We do not have a pushback. It's full forward. But basically, all of them Easy. wants to work with us. The problem for us, not the problem, it was just a uh, matter of time, was to get the product ready. Last month, we, were, uh, we started to do our first cleanings. We are not satisfied with the speed, how, we, how fast we are cleaning. In a few weeks, we will uh, improve th those uh, things we need to improve. And when we will be able to do it fast enough, like uh, one cleaning in two hours, we will start, start to explode. And how do you think about the revenue model? Is it a kind of drone as a service, or do you sell the drone directly to customers and they just take control of it? Uh, I have scaled my first company when I was 18 years old. I was doing hardware as a, as a service. We're building hardware and doing this as, as a service. We're basically building a service company of uh, scaling on service principles. Through franchises, we have 200 companies in the world which are willing to be our franchisees, and uh, that's it. And uh, alternatives to you? Are there any? Not yet. And we are the first company in the world which is uh, doing this. We have four patents on our technology. 
And uh, it's not easy task to build something like that. There are heavily drone companies, which all of them are focused on taxi drone solutions. It's bringing people from point A to point B. Where the first company which is doing heavy lift drone, which is in particular shape, in particular task to, to clean wind turbines, clean buildings, do firefighting, and so on. And how do you move to the adjacencies? Once you've done wind turbine, how do you move to fire and, and building? And uh, when we started the company, we didn't know that we will clean or we'll, we will do the firefighting. The main idea was that there are small, a lot of small drone companies. There are a lot of planes in the sky. There is plenty of space in between. So uh, we started to develop this drone, and somehow it came by itself. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you very much.